I would just point to, and this is something I wanted to impart to uh, is it David Carr on NFL Network. David's asking, where is the matchup for the Packers without 17? I look at it and I go, this is not a 13-win team. I said the other day, I'm like, and this might get me in trouble, but I said Green Bay doesn't win eight games. Oh, my gosh. And I just said it on TV now. Why would that get you in trouble? I don't know. I'm just, I don't know. I, I have a feeling Spend like. Spend some time on Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, join me. Aaron please. Nagler thinks they're going 17-0. and 0. Now you want to sit here and say they're not going to win like, eight games? Show me where the matchup is for Green Bay. Like, it's always been Devontae Adams and then everyone else. Aaron Jones can get off and he can have his yards. I just don't know if I see that. Like, I would only point to the seven games that Matt LaFleur has won with Aaron Rodgers at quarterback while Devontae Adams was out. There are plenty of opportunities in this passing game and in this scheme to open up and get things going with your tight ends, your running backs out of the backfield, guys like Alan Lazard, who we've seen come to the fore that week three game against the Saints a couple years ago. There are going to be plenty of opportunities. And this idea that they're going to just fall off the map on offense is downright laughable. So, yes. Please watch the tape of those games if you need to see, quote, where the matchup is for Green Bay. It's all over the place. It's like the Matrix. It just materializes. That's how good LaFleur is, and that's how good Aaron Rodgers is, and that's how good they are together. Take that to the bank.